Yeah. What's that? Oh, wait, awesome. Yeah, I was gonna say, it's pretty well camouflaged, whatever it is. Looks like we just found some sort of clock, guys. Yeah, right there. So there's some sort of statue here, guys. And it looks like some sort of flower or something. That could be poisonous, though, so I shouldn't mess around with that. Well, now you're gonna have to burn those gloves. Yeah, I know, pretty much. So we just found this statue. Yo, what's that? You and me and the coven makes three. Dude, look. What? It's the M with the top hat. Like somebody was like going in a zigzag here, dragging their feet. That's exactly what that looks like. And then there's something here. Be one of us. And then it says fortune teller. What the hell is he doing? Let's go. Welcome back guys to the exciting new adventure of Randonautica. I am here with Exploring with Angelo. We're back baby and we're doing Randonautica. <laughs> so anyways guys. So we were actually ran uh, his first point, and what, what do you said it was? It was a uh, witch's grave. Witch's grave. Witch's grave. And what's really, really funny is that it actually did bring us to this cemetery. And his point is actually way back there. I'm going to set my own point actually in the area. So when I'm back there, I'll set my own, and we'll go from there. All right, guys. I'm gonna get excited. Um. So there's some people that have been asking what Randonautica is. It's this app. You can get it. It's is it free or you have to pay for it? I, I yeah, it's free. You can get free daily tokens. So okay. If you get one of those, then you gotta pay for it. But. So yeah, so this app is free on on Google Play. You can get it. Uh, it it spawns, it spawns coordinates in your Google Maps or GPS system. Now based on intent. What I find really really funny though, I talk to people a lot about this. Um, some of the intents that you guys come with, they're actually not intentions because it's, it's supposed to be like your mind, you know what I mean? Like it's psychologically based, you know, are you going in with good intent or mal intent or whatever? But anyways, uh, we still use them anyway, whatever you guys get. Um, a lot of it was psychology based. So if you have good intent, maybe your intentions will lead you somewhere peaceful if they're bad or if you're just having an off day, maybe it might be evil or scary or creepy. But for those have, who have been watching the channels, they've seen how um, things get really wild depending on these intents and some crazy stuff happens. And that's what really got it booming. But anyways, guys, we're going to get this show on the road and just see and see what we can find. All right. OK, bye. Yeah. Yeah, so I've never actually seen if this place is haunted, but it is It is old. A very old cemetery, very old stones. Some of the, uh... Yeah, some of the stones look really, really nice. Really, really nice. Went down in the cemetery looking for love. Back down where my baby was buried, I had to dig a rope. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, there's literally like five of them. All kind of... I'm wondering if it's the same family or if it's possibly that they, they just categorize it, like keep it in order, like it's very ordered. Yeah. Probably. Yeah, so we just found this old, uh, oh, wow. old grave with Angelo. That yeah. does look wild. It actually looks kind of nice. It is nice. Mm -hmm. So the actual, like, stone part is here. No, 
No farewell words were spoken. No time to say goodbye. You were gone before you knew it. And only God knows why. Oh, that's sad. Damon Alfred. Floyd uh, Kip Kipperman? You know what, though? For, like, affordability, that looks really, really nice. Yeah, I know cool. it's just made out of wood, but that's really, really mm -hmm. nice. Well, that's how they used to do them back in the day. They all used to be, like, wooden crosses. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so there's some... I think my point was, like, back here somewhere. Okay. Do you one? still hear that screeching sound, I whatever it is? Periodically, I don't know where the hell it's coming from. Yeah, I, I was gonna say. It's really wild, so I always get people like, oh, I love when you guys are together doing it. We're gonna try to do some more random not videos together this month, so I'm pretty excited about that. For his trip, so. I always feel bad when I see stones like about to topple over or move. There's actually a neat one up here, Angelo. It looks like there's a statue of a head or something. I don't know what that is. Yeah, so we're checking it out. The beautiful sky going on here. Really wild. Yeah, there's like a... Oh, wow! There is an angel. That is wild. Yeah. That's cool. Cool. Mm hmm Oh wow, nineteen twenty eight. Interesting. Oh, look at that big pile of wood back there. Is that where the witch's grave is? <laughs> you tell me, sir. I don't know. Well the point was just like right there, but clearly there's nothing going on over there. How big was like the radius? Um, not that big. Okay. The fact that it brought you to a cemetery though is pretty, pretty wild. Look at all this. To uh, say the less. All these, uh, oh, what is that? Hmm. Oh, okay. So that's probably just a piece of uh, oh, what is that? equipment. Yeah, I thought it was a grave. I think it's uh, just like the shovel like part of a machine. Yeah. What they used to dig the graves. Yeah. There's a bunch of equipment back there too, so we're probably not even supposed to be back here. Yeah, I think this is the cemetery staff, the maintenance people. It's kind of wild though, it's like to see that there's still staff working a cemetery that like. Because I, I, don't, I don't think they still bury people here. I mean, they might. I think they do. Because mm -hmm. it looked like a bunch of the ones down there are all, uh... Oh, newer year? Newer year. Okay, okay. Yeah, there's a bench there. Cool cemetery, though. Yeah, see, like, this thing is in you. 2021, see? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Oh, nice. It's a bench. Mm. Yep, so we just got here before nightfall. His point actually was bang on the money. That's what I mean. Sometimes you get really, really lucky with these intents, and you will find something that um, that does go with whatever is uh, popped in. I think the first, I think the best one I ever found it was a it was like a stainless steel dragon, and the intent was to do with something flying, and I thought that that was just unreal. Yeah. All right, guys, so I think we're gonna, we're going to continue on. So be sure to uh, stick with us, okay? Ready? I'm ready, buddy. Okay. Yep, so his point's actually off this way. I think mine's more off on the right, so I'm hoping that it's actually on a trail. What do you think of this place, big guy? Pretty spooky, eh? Yeah. I mean, I'm so used to all the different forests. Yeah, <laughs> it's just a bunch of trees. 
Yeah, it is. Yeah, so mine's off to the right. I'm hoping that it's not like off, off trail. I'm hoping it's on some trail system. Mm hmm. Last thing I like doing is trekking through like long grass or field or all that kind of jazz. So. Yep, so I know a lot of you were concerned about like my health. Things have been fine. I've been taking care of things. What, did you see something? Yeah, I, I see something like reflecting. It's just probably the like, Yeah. Oh, sweet. It is a trail. Oh, thank God. Because I didn't want to go off trail. So, like, yeah. It says that my point's out this way. All right, so you uh, check out that side and I'll continue on this way. All right, brother. Okay. All right, guys. So we're checking out this area here. Into the abyss is what I call this. Oh, boy. I don't like it when we split up, but I know it's part of the rando gig, and it's just something we have to do if we're going to get used to using the app again. But I'm back. I'm back at it. Happy that I'm back to work. It's been a while. So my first point is actually out in this direction here. So this is the uh, this is the radius. I'm a little nervous. It looks like it's kind of squared off. I don't know what this is, guys. Wait a second. What the heck is that? Okay, so there's definitely something here, and there's something up here as well. Okay. You have arrived. Okay, so I found this really creepy looking teepee. I'm just going to put this flashlight away and just examine this for a sec, guys. Luckily, mine came with the pouch just like Angelo's. It's basically a, a rip-off of the uh, Olight. I can't afford stuff like that yet, unfortunately. Olights are very expensive, and I'm still still gaining money working and stuff, so it's... Hello? I heard something. Oh. It's probably just Angelo. He's right there. What is this? So I just found this, guys. I don't know what it is. It's like a statue with a person that it almost looks like injury, like their face is all all wrapped. Does it say anything? What is this? Atelier Corbina Zibinic. I don't know what language this is, guys. You guys can look that up yourselves. Hmm, there's nothing really on the back. There's just like the sticker of probably where this was bought. It's kind of odd that we found this. This is really weird. Okay, what is this? What is it, a bobblehead? Okay, so we just found this here. Oh, well that's disturbing. So it's like a blacked out face, bobblehead of an angel. It says, my little angel. And there's nothing written on the book that she's holding. Does it say anything? Oh wait, hold on. It says, go to heaven. Well that's kind of, uh, that's a little bit disturbing, if I might say so myself. <laughs> Like, that's just weird. It's actually cooler out today. I wore a jacket and a hoodie, so that's why I'm kind of bundled up, trying to keep warm. Uh, but this forest is very, very creepy. I think I've only ran out of this area one time, and it was actually the beginning of my career, so. But, I don't know. 
I think what we're gonna do guys is we'll set one more point here and then I'm gonna just uh, yeah so we'll set one more point here random nodding and then I think that after that I'll just uh, I'll meet up with Angelo to set more because I just don't I'm just a little nervous doing this myself again um, I'd rather be with a buddy, but obviously we both like running the app and having it going so so anyways I'll meet up with you guys later and check out the next point All right guys, so we're checking out the next point now This one's down this way This one says that it's on the uh, right hand side and this one is definitely off trail. I Really don't like that I kind of like that that one was actually pretty close. Like I didn't feel like I was way off. What's in here? Ooh, it's just like a bunch of trees. I'm always looking and expecting something or someone to jump out at me. I really don't like that. Oh wow, okay, we found some sign. The human landscape, for thousands of years, these hills were visited by Aboriginal people, but by the early 1800s, British and European settlers were starting to arrive in newly discovered for them lands. Settlers from Scotland started arriving in this area in the 1820s, shortly after the township of Mono was surveyed. They were attracted by the offer of free land. One such family was that John and Martha Turnbull, who arrived with five children, 10, eight. So this is just talking about like the history and stuff like that. I won't go too crazy with that, but that's kind of cool to say the least. Trees everywhere, guys. That's the thing. Yeah, like my point is out. This way. So I'm just gonna have a peek. I'm being very quiet because I just don't. I don't know what else is out here. seeing anything. Is anyone out here? Was oh, that you? Oh, thank God. You scared the crap out of me. Yeah, buddy? I don't know. There's just three trees. Hold on, what's that? Okay. What is this? Just over here, I found something. Just light up the way so you can see where I'm going. <laughs> I'm so nervous doing this by myself again, man. I can tell you that right now. Been a little while to random knot. I got the heebie-jeebies going. Found something disturbing though. I don't know what it is. I'm, I'm kind of afraid to open it, to be honest with you. Whew. Did you find anything? Was it disturbing? <laughs> yeah, so he's looking at that plaque I just saw here. I'm just gonna open this. See what this is, guys. This actually isn't the first time I've found one of these heart-shaped boxes. Okay. What is this? It's disturbing. Oh my God, are you joking me? 
Ellis abduction. Oh my god. You gotta be f***ing kidding me. Yeah, you, you should come here. Because I'm finding this cult sh again. Just have your knife handy if any, if anything, like, this is weird. <sighs> Somebody left me a little present, it seems. There's no way this is playable, guy. This thing is smashed up. It says, Ellis Abduction. Is anything written on the back of it, though? Is anybody out there? I don't like this. Nope. One bit. Let's see. 1984, October. I don't really want to stay right here. This is a little much for me. You got your knife, eh? Because yeah. I don't have mine today. Oh. Yeah, I don't have yeah, a knife. I have mine over here, so we're good for that. Okay, I'm getting tired of games, guys. You want to come out and show yourself? And fight about it? I can't stand these they, Now they're leaving me little presents. Oh my god. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. I don't want to be in this. I don't want to be here right now. Probably just fell off a tree or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. I hate these freaks. I hate them. I can't stand them. Like, they're just evil. What is this, anyway? I found this little chain thing. It says... Yeah, I'm gonna walk because I don't want to stay here. I'm gonna try to read this as we walk, though. It says something. Amor Vincit Omnia. I don't know. Angelo, is this Italian? It sounds like it is, but I don't know. What does it say? It says, Amor Vincit Omnia? Um, does that mean anything? Well, it means love. Is that Italian, though? I'm not sure. Not I don't enough. know what language it is. Vin Vincit Omnia. It sounds like a name or something. Yeah, I just found that, guys. But we were hearing sounds in the bushes back where we found it. It didn't sound like footsteps to me, though. It sounded like somebody throwing rocks at us or something, eh? Yeah, I heard something. But it looked like maybe a branch or something fell off the tree. Yeah. So. Was it closer to you? I like no, I, I could just like, kind of hear it, like, kind of off. Yeah, it was kind of, like, off in the bush. Mm-hmm. But I'm pretty sure I saw one, like, just fall. Because, I mean, these trees are really old, so. Yeah. Okay. I guess what we'll do is we'll continue on. I like and don't like splitting up at the same time because, oh, okay, that's just a, <laughs> my eyes are playing tricks on me now. Mm. But yeah, I noticed that a lot of you were concerned. Um, my health's been fine. I've been, I know, I'm just doing what the doctor tells me to do. So all that's good there. Um, I'm, I'm glad that I'm back at it again. I couldn't be more happy having Angelo by my side because I told you guys I feel safest with him. I feel safe with Brayden too. Though. He's pretty he's pretty tough. <sighs> pretty dense forest though, eh buddy? Like this place is actually massive. There's just trees everywhere. So I've actually found heart-shaped boxes before. It's really funny because every time we find a heart-shaped box, there's somebody in the comment section talking about Nirvana. What was a white guy like? What the hell is that? Or it might just be... Yeah, it's, it looks like it's moving. Like you're seeing something out that way? Yeah. Huh. I saw something. Like I said though, buddy, if if the cult is here, I've told people before, this cult follows me. They seem to, I don't know if they're tracking me by my phone, I don't know what, but they seem to follow me, so 
I'm just a little bit anxious right now. No, it was just you. Was it just that sign? Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. I thought there was actually a light, but yeah, it was just a sign. Okay. Okay. I don't know, did you want to set a new point and kind of go from yeah, there? Yeah, I guess. I was going to go a little further in. I want to see what's up that way and then... Uh... Okay, we can do that if you want. Yeah, we can do that. It's not a problem. What was creepy too, see like just see how this is all set up here with the fence. I'm just like, oh my god, I'm going into the abyss. So. This place will get to you though. You will hear sounds and things. I know when me and Brayden were here, yeah. we checked my car for trackers because somebody actually, somebody actually broke into my car when I was here last. That's always fun. I know. It's and it's funny because like out of out of all the people, all the YouTubers, how many times can you can you can you even count? Your car has been broken into, eh? I've only to me only had to happen once. Mm -hmm. I brought Brett. It was well, you're a, one of the lucky ones, I suppose. I yeah. Mean, a lot of people have stopped doing this shit. So, mm -hmm. but I'm contemplating sometimes like whether I want to continue doing this or not anymore. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. So we made it to my point. It's actually down this way. This. Yeah, this is wild, eh? Yeah. yeah. So I think we're about to see something really, really neat here. like somebody was hacking some wood or something down there. Did you hear that? Yeah, I did. Alright, um, <laughs> wanna lead the way? <laughs> okay. Here we go. Alright guys. A little nervous because I have been followed here before. And we've been hearing sounds all night. Would you hear something? No, no, I'm just taking this in. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, it's wild. It's really like a, almost like a subtle like wine coming from down there. I don't know. Whatever it is, it gives me the heebie-jeebies, I can tell you that. <laughs> Beautiful, eh? So these are millions of years old, guys. These go back to the dinosaur ages. Yeah. <laughs> say, yeah. Yeah. The big majority of natural rock formations are <laughs> millions of years old. My bad. Uh -huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so this is the point, guys. I think it's just I literally think it's just this. It's this beautiful area down here. I love it. I just saw something down there. Did? I just when I saw something like me. What was that? That was me. Okay. Hello? I don't know. I've never passed this point before, ever. Yeah, those are snakes, deer, and foxes, and mice. <laughs> um, I don't know what the sign says, but... <laughs> <laughs> you want to see what's past here? Yeah, That's we can check it out. We'll have to be careful. Yeah. But yeah. Looks like it could be interesting. So the last time I was here, I found something right under here under these floorboards oh so that's why i was kind of like that's kind of odd because i've been to this this was a point before yeah. 
so I couldn't see it, you know what I mean, me seeing something else. But yeah, we should go explore. I mean, we're bound to see something cool it is down after there. Hours. The sign only applies to during the day, obviously. That's yeah. what it says, right? So, exactly. Um, let's go. Okay. Um, so I'm not sure what an easier way would be. Be if we just want to try this side or yeah maybe down here because yeah. it looks like there's no drop right here Angela this side? yeah yeah you can kind of just get down here it's just hard to kind of squeeze through there so hopefully we can you're about half my size so you might have an easier time but yeah if you want to go happen. ahead See like water bottles and things like that. You okay? Yeah, I'll give you some light there, dude. Yeah, like I see water bottles. Wow, there's actually enough space you could, you literally could go down. Oh dude, there's a little shoe. What? Yeah, there's a little tiny shoe under there. It looks like a little crock. It's Jazz's shoe. <laughs> so he just found this little crock underneath. Okay, that? whatever. That's a little weird. Lots of like plates for food and things like yeah, that. Yeah, I don't know what the deal is with people. I hate when people leave trash all over the place. I do too. Yeah, so I guess just be careful on this side. Maybe just kind of tilt your body. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> He's about to go through. <laughs> it's not so bad. Alrighty. Alright. I see that there's a lot of beer cans too, which is disturbing. So a lot of people party and whatnot down here. Yeah. Oh, there's a thistle. That's kind of cool. Just a little thistle there. I hope so too. Do you even know what that looks like? I don't know it's what like, it looks like. It's like three leaves. Like okay. Something like this, like we just walked through. Okay. No, I'm just kidding. So wash <laughs> your clothes when you get home, maybe? I mean, I think they're, they're smaller. I always forget what it looks like, but... Yeah. Um, have you ever walked through that stuff before? I haven't. I probably have and just never noticed. It's yeah. Wild. It's wild, dude. It's like it's, it's like it's a trail. Yeah. But me, it's like off, though, so it's... Yeah. Yeah, so we're just staying away from like the natural rock land formation. So there's that here. But it looks like it continues on here. That wasn't me. Where did you hear it come from? Who's out there? I don't know. So we heard sounds coming from this direction here, guys. Yeah, it keeps going, dude. This is so weird. It is like a... It's almost like a trail, though. Which is odd. Yo. Dude, there's something up here. What? Looks like a cave. Holy mackerel. 
That's wild. I don't know if you want to climb it. I might just go check it out. It's pretty steep though. Oh wow. <laughs> yeah. I know I heard that too. Hello? Mr. Deer? Okay. Well, okay. Okay, so we'll have be to be careful. I will. Those rocks could easily fall. I know. And, uh, I just can't see any person or thing being up here. Yeah. It looks just too jagged for anything to go up here. So I think I'm safe that way. I guess just just cover her ass down here. Yeah, I'm gonna go take a glance at what might be down this way. All right, buddy. Whew, looks like I have some climbing to do, guys. So I'm going to have to be very careful. People hate me doing this sort of thing because I've got family at home and everything. Like, oh, wow, look at this. There's like fossils and stuff in the rocks. You know, like I said, guys, this is like millions of years old. You never know if you could find like a dinosaur bone or something in these rocks. But I imagine if uh, other people have checked this place out, like people doing the park, they would have found it before we did, but there's lots of cool uh, fossils inside. What is up here? Alrighty, I might need both hands for this part, guys. So I might need both hands for this part. So I'm just going to set my camera down for a moment because I just don't want to fall. I'm going to see if I can stake it up here, though. That way you guys can get a bit of the action climbing. Okay, let me see here. I don't know if I can put it up here. Actually, no. I better just stake it here. I don't want to try to play hero and then lose my camera. Okay. Come on, Brad. One, two... What was that? Is somebody up there? Nothing, I just heard a sound. It's coming from up here. Okay, I'll check it out. Okay. What's up there? Yo, what the hell is this? It looks like some sort of flask, guys. And it says, uh... It says, drink me. So we just found this now. What is this? Okay. Yo, I found something! Yeah, I found something up in the cave! That is so wild, guys. I can't believe we just found this. Like, it's up in this cave. So it says, drink me. And then we just found this fish thing. <sighs> Alright, I'm coming back down now. Let's have to be careful because it's very, very steep. <sighs> I heard a sound coming from, like, the top of the cave. And I was like, what the hell's that? So I come up here. And I'm literally, I heard it way, way up there, but I, I decided to just kind of turn my camera just to see if there was, like, anything over here, and I found this. I don't know what it is. It doesn't mean anything to me. I found, like, a... Okay, so we better not stay here too long. All right. Woo! That's a bit of a drop. Okay, guys, so I'm going to have to... Be very careful coming down because it's much more dangerous coming down than it is going up. By the sounds of things. One foot down, easy does it. Easy does it. Woo. Okay, there we go. That's smarter. Here I was gonna jump. 
I don't know if you'll make anything out of this. I found a flask. Yeah, you can check that out. And there's a little thing on it. It says, drink me. Drink me. And then I just found this. Oh, what the f What, does that mean anything to you? Um, I mean, it might. You want to take your flask? Yeah, so yeah. So I have been finding these ever since we went to that one spot where I ran into the guy with the f taser, if you remember that. Yeah, yeah. I've been finding these non-stop, like all over the place. Oh my god. I think it's the same, I don't know. Unless it's just some weird, like, geocaching thing, but it doesn't make any sense. Mm -hmm. When I was in the house the other day, the dude literally left one of these in, like, a, a weird, like, music box. I don't know okay. what the hell's going on if this dude's, like, a serial killer or some weird creepo who's, like, following me everywhere and then just leaving this. Don't know what the hell it means, but I think we need to get the hell out of here. Okay, let's just see, yeah. dude, yeah. Yeah. For now. Um, I heard like a screech. I thought it was some sort of animal yeah, or something. A and a bunch of uh, coyotes off in this direction. Okay. So... Yeah, so we're going to make our way out of here. Just be very careful. I almost fell a few times. Oh, yeah. All right, so I'm going to put this in my back pocket just so I don't make a trip because I'm going to need both my hands, guys. Pretty cool place though, eh? Yeah. To say the least, so. Okay. Careful. Okay. Oh. I need a little jump there. Yep, we just follow the path. It's wild though, Angelo. It led us right to it. Like, and it's... So I'm guessing that this might have been part of the trail system at one point. Maybe, yeah. Yeah, I've never I've ever passed that point. I've only been to that point up there. So it's really wild. We found some sort of cave. I don't know who would be crazy enough to live in these woods. This place is just really wild. You could easily get hurt here. I can easily say we got our steps in this time, buddy. A lot of walking, climbing. Oh my God. I don't think I needed a hoodie today from the amount of work we did. Okay. Welcome back guys to this next exciting Aranda Nautica. I am here with Exploring with Angelo. Mm -hmm. You guys have been begging us to do this again and here we are. Uh, this is a totally new forest uh, for for us, so like we're really checking this out. I do, I have no idea what to expect. Um, we've had some really close encounters with some really disturbing people the past few times. Um, so, anyways, as always, guys, I'm going to drop your intent just below, so you guys will see that. Uh, but yeah, I think we, let's boogie. Get this thing show on the road. I'm always creepy at night. It's always the nighttime that gets gives me the jitters. So you, you are very creepy at night. Yeah, I am. <laughs> very creepy. Show. So you've been telling me you've had some close encounters yourself. Yeah, just a bit. Um, I found the uh, possible mur murderer again. Oh yeah. Yeah, that was a that was a bit much. I'd That's say. disturbing. I got literally within maybe like 15 feet of this guy in oh total darkness. God. I don't know what his deal is, but he didn't hurt you or anything, though. No. Huh? No. Okay. I, mean, I got a few scratches and scrapes and whatnot. But... As long as you're okay, I care that all my friends are well and the kids are all healthy. Right. <laughs> the kids are all right. <laughs> 
<laughs> I like that. Yeah, so. This isn't my point. Hmm? So it says that my point's actually in this area somewhere. You have arrived. Like I'm not seeing anything like right here. No. You seeing anything from your end? You, what's that? Yeah, I was gonna say it's pretty well camouflaged, whatever it is. Okay. Dude, it looks like a clock. Yeah. Okay, so it looks like we just found some sort of clock, guys. I'm gonna bring this out just so we can have a peek at it. I know, it's very bizarre too. It was almost like it was built like little pieces of wood. Yeah, yeah. Let's see if there's anything. Like layer by layer. Oh, dude, look, there's something oh. right there. Yeah. There's like a piece of paper or something stuck inside of it. All right, hold on. Oh. What was that? I don't know. Did you hear that? Yeah. What was that? Hello? What the hell? Oh, there's someone there. Yeah, I know, I don't know. What the hell is he doing? Can we help you? Holy smokes. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Holy crap. Okay, what the hell, dude? So messed up. What the hell was that? I don't even know. Oh my god, I just heard like some sort of moan or something. That creeped me out. <sighs> Holy fudge. I couldn't even get this note out. I was trying to use a stick or something to get it out. Oh, you yeah, like I was I was literally trying to examine it and buddy just made some sound. There's too many weird people living in these forests, man. Yeah, it's like really jammed in there. I don't know what this is, but yeah, it's like a clock and it's just It's kind of cool looking. It looks like a puzzle Yeah, it does. It, it's like it's it's almost like a model or something yeah. that you know like you it doesn't look like it comes apart though. No, it doesn't. Interesting. I don't know what this thing is here All right, let me just Thanks, man <laughs> It's impossible well, uh, doing it with one hand. Might as well be useful. What the hell? Henry's Late twice, excuses all he knows, but Mallory's punctual. Dre clocked in, she's always on the go. Last comes Sydney doing what she's told. There's something blocked out there. Bam Ta. What does it look like? Another language or something? Yeah, look, look at that. See that? What the hell is that supposed to mean? In a row? Something in a row? It just looks like some sort of puzzle, like they want us to solve it with the clock. Okay, so guys, we just found this. I've never found anything like this before. This is really weird. So Henry's late twice, excuse so he knows. But Mallory's punctual. D R E I. Clocked in, she's always on the go. Last comes Sydney, doing what she's told. What are all these noises I'm hearing right now? I don't what know. What is going on? Like we're hearing airplanes and... A few minutes ago we were hearing like fire trucks and stuff. Yeah, like... 
rescue. <laughs> But uh, we don't know what these uh, words mean, guys, at the bottom there. It looks like another language, so maybe uh, one of you subs could uh, figure out what this means. I don't know. So I'll just have the camera on here just for a few, few moments so you can take a peek. I know what this is. So these in brackets, that's, that means adjectives. But I, I cannot read this language. I don't know what it means. And it's obvious that they're trying to get us to do a puzzle because, look, and if you see the clock, it's literally not set up. That's what's creepy because, yeah, I like, thought I, heard something I, know. I know. I don't know if that person like left or. That's what disturbs me, bro. Because I don't want to get jumped tonight. You know what I mean? like another piece of paper in that bush or is that just uh no i think this was i think this is literally it oh. i'm probably gonna leave the clock down here somewhere i'm taking this note though i don't know what this is i kind of want to find out what this dude was up to like this is disturbing he's gone that's for sure oh. I heard something. yeah i did too it's like a branch broke yeah. Okay, just, uh, keep on the lookout. Yeah, exactly. Okay, now I heard something on the left side. I know. What the hell is that? Who's out there? something there. Mm -hmm. I can't see them though. Is there like a freaking moose in there or something? I don't know. Like it's hard to tell if it's an animal or if it's a human being. Because there was that creepy guy that we just saw. I don't see him though. That's creepy. It's coming from the bush. There he is. What the hell is that? Okay. What the f? Okay, um, I'm creeped out. Stay back. Okay, what the hell, the hell, hell is going on? on right now? So messed up. All right, stay back. I'm telling you. What the hell is this guy? What the hell? Okay. Who the hell is this guy? Okay, okay, okay stay back, stay back. I'm, t I'm warning you. Get the f*** out of here. Yo. Come on. What the hell? What the shit? Who is, is this going? guy? What the frig is going? Go, 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 go. Okay. Alright, stay back, stay back. Stay back there, man. What 
that is just disturbing. <gasps> Holy shit. Holy shit. What the hell was that? I kind of want to still we search for my point. I think he's gone. We didn't get there at all, did we? No, we didn't get there. But he, he would be down that way, though. So he'd be in the clear, you know what I mean? I hope Buy us some time. Well, he didn't see us come in here. Nothing visible at all. Alright. Whew, I'm glad you brought your knife too. Just to be on the safe side. Yeah. Holy smokes. We waited and hid for a long enough time. He would be down the trail that way, so we should be fine now. I mean, if the dude was around, we would have heard him. I know. A lot of these trails, too, they have different ways to the parking lot. You know what I mean? If we had to dip around or find something out this way, there might be. I don't know. This place is just too much. Yep. But yeah, my point is off this way, so... Okay. Uh, lead the way, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Alright, guys. Just have my light out right now because me and Angelo got chased by some psychopath. I don't know what to expect when I'm in these places. I really don't know. I'm coming closer up to the point, so... Just trying to make sure that there's nobody... Nobody hiding, that's the problem, right? We don't want to be jumped while we're coming through here. So... Yeah, my point's somewhere up this way. So, I'm just gonna check it out. Oh, you okay, man? Yeah. Okay, sweet. I get nervous. I'm like, I hope that he didn't get picked off and then I'm left here by myself. Whoa, dude. Do you see that? There's, there's something oh. there. I don't, it's not just like part of a tree or something? I don't know. It's like white. It actually caught my eye, bro. Yeah, right there. There's something there. Okay, what is this? We just found something in the woods, guys. Okay, what is this? Wow, what is this? So there's some sort of statue here, guys. It looks like some sort of flower or something. That could be poisonous, yeah, though, so I shouldn't mess around with that. Well, now you're going to have to burn those gloves. So. Yeah, I know, pretty much. So we just found this statue. Yo, what's that? You and me and the coven makes three. Dude, look. What? It's the M with the top hat. Remember how I was finding that? Oh, yeah. This has been a thing since I started Randonautica. The top hat man or whatever his name was? Yeah. 
Okay, so there's some sort of, uh, some sort of note right here, guys. I don't know what this thing is. Would you be able to open that, bro? Yeah. Sorry about that. So hard with one hand. Oh, no. It's tricky. Um, oh, what the hell? What is this? Oh. Oh my of, god. It's kind of neat, actually. I don't know what the hell that is, but... I've actually found something like this before. It says, Lady Mallory, our prophet, and it says Toby on it. Who the hell is like, Toby? What the hell was that? Yo, what was that? Yo. Is someone there? Okay. Yep. Yep, there's somebody there. Oh, okay. holy that's, smokes. That's the scene. Okay. okay. Holy smokes, that creeped uh, me out. No, what is going you. on? You, you can stay there. Um, How the hell did he get over here? Listen, man, just stay back. Just get the fuck out of here. Okay. Oh, oh. Bridges are breaking. I don't know, man. Like, we've been hunted this whole freaking night. Screw you, a**hole. What the hell? No, look, look, there's somebody there. What the hell's going on? What in the banana and pajamas is this? What, is he small? Look. Okay, no. What the hell? No grudge tonight. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know, Halloween's not for another few months, right? Look, man, we don't want any trouble here, okay? We don't want any trouble. Just go back to doing what you're doing, okay? Leave us be, alright? You know... My heart's going like... I'm not gonna lie. What but. the f what in the actual f Angelo? Well, is that like, know is what that like is that like the guy from before? Who the, the hell is, is this? Yeah, I'm getting out of here. Honestly, I could uh, definitely use an EMW burger right about <laughs> <you know>, here. <and laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, Our go-to. I don't he's know. He's stalking stop us. Stop coming towards us. Just stay there. Yo, just stay there, man. Like, back the f up. Oh, look. Yo, is he going back into the woods? What the hell? What the hell is he doing? Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh my god. It's about time to follow me. These are the people, the forest, the honestly bro, honestly bro, these are the people that I've been talking about. They think that they're vampires. Like they actually think that they're creatures of the night and they're messed up. I think he's gone. I wouldn't be so sure, I don't know. Nope. Have you seen some? Yo, there's somebody there. Oh, okay. He's right there. He's still stalking us. Look, bro! You need to get the hell get the hell away from me, bro. I'm not I'm gonna bro, I'm not even kidding. If you get any closer, I'm gonna I'm gonna freaking I'm gonna kick your ass, man. Okay. Oh shit. Back the f up. Stay back in the woods. You need to stop following me. Holy frig man, get the hell Let's just get out. let's just get the hell out of here. Time to go. Oof. Let's go. Oh shit. Okay. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Holy smokes. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. You're okay. You're okay. Okay. I'm not even kidding, bro. I was close to popping that guy in the face. Okay. What's going on guys? So uh, me and Angelo decided to leave that last point. We were hearing some really creepy sounds. Like I heard like a baby or something like in the woods and then like I heard like a little giggle. We found a lot of disturbing things. We don't really know exactly what they mean. Um, so I decided to set a new point elsewhere. It led us to this trail. So I do see that. I don't know if my camera's picking it up, but there looks like something out there. 
looks like reflecting. I mean, it could be just like another hiker or something with a flashlight. It's not moving. Yeah, you're right about that, sir. Turn off your light for a second. See if okay. See in the no, that's yeah, a, no, I can see it. Light. Okay. Yeah, I'm zooming in right so. now. There's something there. Oh, oh. my god. <laughs> that's weird because I found a flashlight earlier. Mm hmm. This is too much. It's been one crazy night for the two of us. Look at all these apples. I noticed that too. Like, you see all, there's like a crap ton of apples just yeah. falling from trees. It's just that time of year, I guess. Yeah, so there's something up this way. I really hope it's nothing, nothing dangerous. I don't know, man. I never know what to expect. Really all flat trail. This is actually my first time ever being here. I've never been to this trail. This is all brand new. You bring your knife? Nope. nope. Okay, well at least I mean, you can club them to death with that thing if you're I just have to use my fists. No, there's definitely something here, bro. Oh, what, do you see something? No, no, I'm just like wondering what the hell that is. Yeah. Something happened over here. I noticed that too, like what mm. the hell is this? Mm. Someone, I don't know, I mean it could be an animal or somebody was like rubbing their boots or like they got something. Yo, what the hell is this? Are you seeing this right now? What? Oh. Yeah, like it's... Like somebody was like going in a zigzag here, dragging their feet. That's exactly what that looks like. And it looks like, yeah, like it does look like it's leading to this thing. Oh my god. There's this something smiley here. Face? It literally is a smiley face. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god, Angela. Uh, hmm. How do we get ourselves, like honestly, how do we get ourselves in these situations? Like look at this! No like that's like somebody's footsteps going... Yeah, I know, you can clearly see that. And there's really spots. nothing here. Like who's gonna go through this tick infested grass, right? Like... Alright. Weird. I know. I don't know how safe I feel right now with all this going on. This is really... A light on over there. Yeah. Oh boy. What is this? There's definitely something here. I literally just hope it's like a memoriam or something. But yeah, no, there's something lit. Like, are you kidding me right now? What is this? Oh, I just tossed it. Oh, okay, you freaked me out there. <laughs> no, there's something here. Oh my god. Yeah, we just found this. Looks like some sort of altar. Um, and then there's something here. What the actual heck is this? Be one of us. And then it says fortune teller. Dude, what is that? I don't know, bro. That is so messed up. Ooh. That does look like I don't want to touch anything. This blood. looks blood. Like that's kind of creepy. I know, it looks almost like a like some sort of ritual, bro. Okay, is this like some kind of joke? I'm I really okay. hope so, buddy. Like that is messed up. What is that? I just heard something. Something moved. Somebody out there? That is so creepy. I can't believe we just found this. So we literally found this, guys. Just chilling here. 
It looks like some sort of ritual site. That is disturbing as all hell. It looks like a baby's face. There's someone out there. Is there? I just saw them. Like out in the field. They're like behind those trees somewhere. Okay, so we are being watched, guys. Yeah, I, I saw him. It almost seems like an initiation yeah. ceremony, dude. He went around the tree and then he just went down really quick. I saw you! Whoever the f you are. You're not fooling anyone, man. You can hear foot you can hear footsteps out there, can't you? I can hear them. That is so messed up. So we found this thing right here. And it almost looks like. This does look like the starseed stuff that I've been finding, no doubt. Like, if you look at it, like, here's the planets. So, Jupiter, Apollo, Mercury, Mars, Atur Saturn, Luna, Venus, Mars. So, I'm wondering now, like, seeing this sort of thing, like, if this has to do with them. Because, like, we have the eye and everything. Like, I know this is a fortune teller thing, but it just it just looks like starseed to me. We've found ritual sites like this before. Very different, obviously. But, like, look Ooh. at this friggin' thing, man. I, I don't even know if I really want to touch this. There's someone down there, too. It looks like human Brad. brain. <laughs> yeah. There's someone down there. I just saw someone down there. Oh, my God. Do you think we should get out of here? Maybe. Holy shit! Holy shit! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! What was that? What was that? What was that? What was that? The noise? There's my flashlight. But there's, there's definitely somebody there though. I know. I don't feel safe here. What's creeping me out, bro? Is the last time we saw, you know, the, the guy, the guy with the hoodie and everything, crouching down. Here, like he was light? gonna jump us, like I'm wondering. Did you see the, the flicker of light? Yeah, I did. I see it right there. It's actually, no, it is showing up in the camera. Yeah, there's a reflection of a sign, but there was something else too. Yeah. No, the cams are picking it up, surprisingly. Okay. Um, Let's just get the f here, dude. Let's get the f even blow that thing out. I don't care. If they can blow out their ritual candle or whatever shit. I saw you. Crazy people, bro. What did they tell you? They've been stalking me for a very long time now. For a very long time. Like it's been months. Every time. So we're heading back to the car. I don't feel safe here whatsoever. We've had too many runs in with these sickos. All I know is they're obsessed. They're obsessed with constellations. They're obsessed with like evil things like vampirism and other shit. And I just, I don't want to deal with it right now. There's people with flashlights hiding out in the woods and they're ready to jump the two of us. The last thing, man, I want is for you to get involved with them because these people are psychos. They will kill you. Did you see someone there? I think so, yeah. They were just here. Like, that was just lit. So long, you prick! These people. All right, guys, so we're gonna get out of here. Um, but for more content, be sure to smash the like button, hit subscribe, we got a lot more to come for you. We're getting in the car and we're just taking off. Rex, man, what was that? Stay away from us, you pricks. Like, freaking.